Hey guys, we're back with another Instagram TV. This is for a recent blog post all about how to develop a new skill. And we've got a set of five tips for you. Yeah, so the first tip is to really understand that it's going to take some effort and to embrace the suck. I don't know who said <laughs> that, but I've definitely heard it quite a bit. And it's a good thing to think about when you're starting to learn a new skill because you're never going to be good at something right when you first start it, no matter what it is. You might have some natural talent and pick things up quickly, but there's always going to be that time when you first start when you're not good at it. And I think having the mentality of kind of embracing that, just knowing it up front goes a long ways in setting you up to be successful to, to learn something new. Yeah. And then the next step is to set your desired performance level. So just out of the gate, decide now like how proficient you want to be at this new skill. Like is it if you want to learn how to play the guitar, for instance, do you just want to be able to sit around on your couch at home and, you know, like strum a guitar and like that like fills the need? Or <laughs> do you want to be a freaking rock star? Like you have to kind of decide what level of proficiency you're going for because that's really going to figure out how much time and investment you're going to put into learning this new skill. Mm -hmm. The third tip we have is <clears throat> to really just only focus on learning one thing at a time. I think this is even harder nowadays with technology and so much information coming at us. It's easy to jump from thing to thing, but what will get you to learn a new skill the fastest is to really just focus on that one that one big skill you're trying to develop so don't try to pick five different things or don't try to learn a new language and play the guitar at the same time one or the other is going to set you up for the most success yeah the next step is to um, break down the steps that it would be required to learn your new skill so it's kind of like creating a curriculum or a roadmap of all of the succession of steps to get you to the level of desired proficiency that you want for this skill. And then you want to break that down into simple steps that you can tackle and accomplish one at a time. Yeah, then you can cross them off and get some <laughs> momentum, which is always helpful. And then the last tip we have for this is to is to commit. So <clears throat> there are several ways you can kind of commit yourself. One is to put it on the calendar, self-commit, um, schedule it out, make sure you're working on it. Another good way to commit is to actually invest some money into it. So either buy a training, pay for a tutor, or something like that will force you to learn that new skill. And a, Another easy way to commit is to tell people about it, say, hey, this is what I'm working on. Um, having other people knowing that you're working on something kind of holds you accountable and gets you going on it. Yeah. So those are our five tips for learning a new skill, and you can check out more in the full post, but also be sure to drop a comment below and tell us what new skill you want to develop.